Ben Taylor in his eighth. And the alternate, Michael Smith in the replay center, Kevin Cutler, and we are ready to go. See Lynn win that tip. It was your personality that... Uh, you think I may turn them yeah. off? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Brogdon able to take it to the hoop. That would be the first yeah. one out in the gym every day, and then he was the champion of the three-on-three -three league after practice was over. Oh, I recall that. That's for set with the button. Support what the coaches are trying to get across, what you need to do to get better, to win games, and those are special people to your roster. And as we mentioned during the course of the game, did not look to be his uh, usual fiery self when he was just uh, upset about the fact that he was not playing that well for seven from downtown the other night. Hachimura able to hit. He was in early foul trouble. Daniel Gafford, 6'11", 246 pounds, second-year man from Arkansas, came over from the Bulls and has played very well. In fact, that is Gafford on the stuff. It's T.J. McConnell has just checked in. He has had a terrific season. Oh, good touch by McDermott. McDermott off the fake. Sabonis and McDermott playing catch and McDermott able to drill it from three. See how hard it is to get back in transition defense when you've got your center rebounding and bust out leading the break kind of like Charles Barkley used to do. Opening quarter off the turnover is Westbrook back on the floor giving it up to Ish Smith and hits on the fadeaway. Sumner hands to McConnell. McConnell spinning in the lane, gets it over to Sabonis, yes, and the foul. Regular season is that Indiana has no one to play this guy, Russell Westbrook. He's too fast, too big, too strong, and too aggressive. And playing well for Indiana, wearing number 88. The spin by Westbrook over to Gafford, who easily puts it home. Here's McConnell on the drive, whips it back out. Reset hits from downtown. You see the ball movement. Indiana trying to get, remember, 35 assists last game for Indi Indiana. Eight players in double feet. Westbrook pops it down. There's the lead, and again, it's Gafford with the put-in. Milwaukee Mavericks and Clippers, Celtics at Nets, and the Blazers at the Nuggets. As the Wizards got it down in a hurt, but Martin not able to hit. Lopez feeling confidence after what he did a moment ago does the same from in close and here is Beal moving it across And the runner by Neto 34 38 in the regular season finishing the number eight spot then lost to the Celtics in the play in the other night Oh nice adjustment as Beal finds Lopez you hear the coach. How about the charges more you got to give up your body You have to have that mental toughness to stick it in there because Westbrook is getting anywhere He wants on the floor. Washington is now 11 for 13 from the field Will that count Lopez on the follow? We drafted him in the fourth round of the 1985 draft and at that time if that player that you drafted did not sign, he went back into the draft the next year as far as block shots go. Oh, a strong drive by Bradley Beal. Oh, a strong drive by Bradley Beal. Bradley Beal averaged 30.3 during the regular Sabonis moves it back out. Brogdon open straight away and knocks it down. Minute and a half remaining in this first half. Nice move by Beal for Washington in this final minute. First half. Wizards shooting 58%. Holiday hands it off to Sabonis. On the hop. Nice pass to set it up. Balls on the floor and guys go down on the floor to get it. Let them play. Okay. Then oh, whoever yes. comes up with it comes up with it. Yeah. 
Syracuse sounds just like a former. Okay, well, right up in the top three every season. Uh, Karis LeVert, potential 20, 25 point score. We see the muscle right there by Hachimura. 14 points for Hachimura, who's had some big games in the regular season against Indiana. Nice touch there by McDermott. Names that you mentioned, the Indiana guys who are missing for them. When you look at bench points in the first half, 19-5 in favor of Washington. Well, by Neto, Westbrook comes up with it. He has Len running alongside, but Westbrook <laughs> takes all the way. Came for Washington and out of a tight double team, Sabonis made a great pass. Hachamora with a beautiful move. Sabonis now has 10 assists. He is on his way to a triple-double. Did Hachimura give us a Dr. J one yeah. hand <laughs> dribble, yeah. lay it up off the backboard? Hachimura back to Beal, catch and shoot. Yes, a three for Bradley Beal. Neto, yes. Dribble penetrate, yet they yep. also spot up and can make shots from the outside. Good, good, solid player. The national team works his way into the starting line. A pretty backdoor pass. Beal with the bucket, and he drew the foul. Just under six to go, third quarter. You know, Marv, Len plays about 20 to 22 minutes a night, and Scott played for, I said, eight before six NBA teams in 10 years. Following an outstanding collegiate career, Sabonis gets the role. There's a miraculous turnaround. There's another block shot. Lynn gets that one. And Beal from downtown. The defense leads to easy offense. Sabonis right back. Sabonis right back. Not a good thing passing the ball inbounds to the other team. Led by Sabonis, who had 14 along with 21 rebounds and nine assists. Here's Bertans and knocks it down following the 0 for 7 from three point range the other night against Boston. He hits his first three point attempt here. But, but you called that. I have to be honest. You said Bertans is going to hit a three. And I said, yeah, if he keeps shooting, he's bound to hit one of them. <laughs> And back come the Wizards. Westbrook for Tom's for three. Blazers open up against the Nuggets on ESPN. That was a terrific game last night, Golden State against the Lakers, Marv. And when we see the three, uh-oh. Tons is off as his fourth quarter gets underway. Ish Smith with the setup. And Chandler Hutchison puts it down. And then you have to deal with Westbrook, but uh, Philadelphia hands to Westbrook. Westbrook had it knocked away, able to recover. Here's Smith. Yes, Ish Smith. Oh, the setup for Bataze turned back, and here is ends up in the hands of Gafford. Smith, oh, for Gafford, beautifully done. Jose able to keep it alive. This is Aaron Holiday. Holiday easily slips by for the bucket. Oh, that was the screen by Batasi. <laughs> yeah. Are you yeah. kidding me? Anthony Gill, the rookie out of Virginia. Under a two-way contract, Smith. There's Gill and once again. 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 Yep, knocking down that face-up three-pointer. Smith and Charles giving away all that money. But in all seriousness, Charles did an incredible thing. We see the block shot at the rim that time, but second shot opportunity by Gill. Anthony Gill, 142 points. And you see the final score, 142-115.